Live activities is probably the most loved water slaving feature, without any doubt whatsoever, designed to make tracking real-time information like live football scores and Uber rides incredibly simple. It has managed to win a lot of hats. Unfortunately, many users have reported that the live activities is not working on their Apple Watches after the Watches 11 soft update. If you also run into this frustrating problem and are looking for ways to fix it, I have got you covered with quick fixes. That's it, let's get started. First off, I would recommend you to ensure that your Apple Watch supports live activities. Bear in mind that the live activities for watchers is still a work in progress. Therefore, it's going to take a while for third-party apps to support this real-time information tracking feature. Before moving any further, make sure your apps are compatible with live activities. Then, I would recommend you to make sure you have enabled live activities for the apps in question. Another important thing that you should do right off the bat is to make sure that the apps are allowed to use the live activities feature on your Apple Watch. To do so, go to the Watch app on your iPhone, then select General. After that, select Auto Launch. Then select Live Activity Settings and then you have to scroll down to find the app in question and select it. After that, ensure that the toggle for Allow Live Activities is turned on. Then be sure that the Live Activities are allowed to launch automatically. It's worth pointing out that Watchers label lets you automatically launch live activities on your Apple Watch. If this auto-launching feature has been disabled on your Apple Watch, it might be causing the problem. Just head over to the Watch app on your iPhone and then select General. After that, choose Auto-Launch. Then select Live Activity Settings and then ensure that the toggle for auto-launch live activities is enabled. Note that Watcher Slave unless you show live activities in the smart stack. If the live activities don't show up in the smart stack, make sure you have enabled this setting. Go to the Watch app on your iPhone. After that, choose smart stack and then ensure that the toggles for allow live activities and auto launch live activities are enabled. Notably, you can also allow or disallow the live activities of a specific app to appear in the smart stack as per your needs. Many a time you can fix the live activities problem by just turning it off and on. Given the fact that it is pretty simple and works like a charm, I would suggest you to give it a go as well. To do so, open the watch app on your iPhone, then select general. After that, choose auto launch and then you have to select live activity settings. And after that, you have to turn off the toggle right next to allow live activities. Then you have to restart your Apple Watch. And once your Apple Watch has rebooted, go back to the Watch app and then re-enable Allow Live Activities Toggle. Then you have to start tracking a live activity like flight status or Uber ride to check if the problem is gone. If it has, then you are good to go. If live activities are not working when using specific apps on your Apple Watch, try updating those problematic apps to get it and launch the App Store on your Apple Watch. Then you have to scroll down to the bottom of the screen and tap on Account. Then tap on Updates and after that you can update all Apple Watch apps at once or do it one by one as per your needs. Should the live activities problem continue to haunt your Apple Watch, why not go for the hard reset solution? Well known for fixing persistent watchers issues, it deserves to be given a chance as well. To get it and you have to hold down the digital crown and the side button at once until you see the Apple logo on the screen. And finally, I would suggest you to update the software on your Apple Watch. If nothing has worked in bringing the ill-functioning live activities back on track, there is a decent chance that a software bug might be behind the issue. So to update the software, you have to open the Watch app on your paired iPhone. Then select General. After that, choose Software Update and then download and install the latest watchOS update as usual and that's pretty much it. So these are the best tips and tricks through which you will be able to fix live activities not working problem on your Apple Watch running watchOS 11 or later. Hopefully you have gotten the better of the problem and live activities have started to work as usual. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy watchOS tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a good time. Bye -bye.